Hands in front now for the draw and the draw only. Draw! Bro, punch it out. Don't stand. Just run us, bro. On the whistle. One round. Ready. Punch it out on the white patch. Press that trigger. Press the trigger. <laughs> Okay, so uh, we're at the Auckland um, live fire facility and the team are uh, learning to uh, use the rifle and the pistol and all the tactical options as well, but basically the focus is on learning to fire both weapons. We understand that everyone starts from scratch, so we, we realise that lots of people have never fired a firearm in their lives. So uh, we start right from the beginning and teach them which, what each weapon is and uh, right through every technique to get them up and running and being able to fire these weapons. Sweet, everyone happy with that so far? Everyone ready to shoot this clock? What's the mechanical makeup? Unload! So this week is week nine and we're spending two weeks at the firearms range over this week and next week. I don't know, there's something about when you're a boy, little boy, you play toy guns at home and now it's real, you know, but um, it's a lot to remember. I was still um, really shaky. Um, it's my first time handling guns, uh, M4 uh, Glocks, um, but all the stuff uh, teaching us really uh, from the basic scratch. So yesterday was the first time I fired a gun, um, so I wasn't too sure what to expect. I didn't realise how heavy the M4 rifle could can be. It's quite heavy. Pretty pleased I got to do that, so it was good. This morning we just done uh, live shooting again with uh, Glock. And just going over all your um, the admin stuff for, for Glock and M4 rifle, making sure it's becoming habit. So yeah, muscle memory, eh? But yeah, hopefully at the end of next week, everything's a lot more confident and yeah, just better at using guns. <laughs> With tech walking, we're in that good fighting stance that we've been talking about all week. Yeah, that soft knees, bum out, shoulders forward if we've got a weapon. Glock, we're in the ready. M4 can be up in the ready, so we're advancing towards the threat. Just nice little steps, heel and toe as I go. As I go, I'm looking around. My head and eyes, I'm looking around for my mates. I've got mates with me, I'm looking ahead for the threat and just keeping aware what's around me. In this situation, we've got guns, we've got hap on, it's a pretty high end situation. We want to be taking it nice and slowly, not rushing to get there, because we've just seen what happens later, and we get a bit stressed, heart rate goes up. Covering. 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 Moving. So first team. <laughs> You're not putting that one on Facebook. Right? If I get bigger one, somebody gonna grab it. Yeah, but it comes up to the top. <laughs> so it's our last day of firearms today. So we're going to be doing some scenario kind of role plays. Um, so we're getting kitted out with radios for the first time. So that's why none of us know how to use it. Um, and then we're gonna kind of go out to do situations where there's offenders and. We're not too sure exactly, but try apprehend them, I'm assuming. Always for the scenarios, eh? Nervous, eh? Because you just don't know. It's good though, we need it because we don't know what we're going to get every time. I suppose 
this job. Eh? I've got um, heart rate monitor. Um, actually, um, Ken Frank, um, he's going to monitor my heart rate. So I think it's going to show how I can perform under pressure. Obviously, if the heart rate is through the roof, then we can see why they potentially might have made a bit of a dumb decision because they, they were cognitively down. I think over time, if we can show them and give them the learnings from the heart rate, and then we can uh, show them the importance of why you have to breathe and consistently look at keeping your heart rate down. So just um, as far as safety goes, all your appointments are in play and also um, empty hand tactics, yeah? So the role players uh, are all live people. Yep. <laughs> are you sure you want to be with me? Uh, oh, we, oh, we'll get I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Oh. No, no, begin! Who's got the box? Stay where you are, don't move. You come any closer, stay where you are, take a step back. We just got off the car and just say to X how we got trained, so I don't know how he went, but um, yeah, it was really good, yeah, yeah, best practice maker, um, best cop. <laughs> Ari and I will do it in normal time and then we'll talk about the uh, the breakdown of it or the minutiae. Do you like that word? Minutiae? Yeah. Write it down bro. Write it down. <laughs> minutiae. <laughs> it's like a, it's we'll copyrighted man.